Heading into my junior year of robotics, it has become clear to me that um, teams have excluded one key aspect that ultimately will boost their winnings by a lot. Only, yeah, only the top world teams have um, implemented this and it converts to them winning more. And this is, this goes into the rules. Now, you know, you have your builder, you have your driver, you, you might have a notebook, right? But one rule that is key to winning more of your games is actually the role that I have been in, which is a strategist or analyst. Now, essentially this role, um, you become the master of knowing what to do during a match. So with this, you, you and the driver need to be in sync so that whatever you say, the driver will trust you and will do as you say. Without that being said, this role requires probably probably the most amount of time out of any role. I mean, the builder is going to be taking up a lot of time, but to, to really excel in this role, you're going to have to be spending like an hour or two a day. And that's because there's a lot to do to become perfect, be know every scenario, do quick thinking. And coming into this year, pushback, it's going to require a lot of quick thinking. Now, um, there's different sections that you have to do in order to excel in this role. First, you need to know your teams. Now, what I mean by this is you need to study your opponents. You need to study what they do. Like, what do they do in the last 30 seconds? How do they start off the game? How do they cooperate with um, their alliance partners? And this essentially lets you know, like, when you fa actually face them, you know what the opponents are going to do, and you can work your strategy around that. Um, and with that, um, what I started doing around the end of the season, but it works really well, is taking a big old notebook, studying every single team that will be in that tournament, and just grab stats on them, like, Really see their win to loss ratio. How good are they? Take notes. Like, do they have like can they can they park well? Can they score fast and all that stuff? So when you get to the competition, you can flip through that notebook and be like, oh yes, this team is decent, but they don't really like the park. And uh, you can cooperate with them on what to do, or you can be like, ah, oh, this is not a good teammate. And our opponents are pretty good, so um, let's spend some extra time before the match to figure out how we're exactly going to win this game. And that's what that, that's really why this role is key to winning more games is because I mean the driver, the driver can drive if the dri you have a good driving, but ultimately it's this game comes down to strategy and the driver is definitely a key factor in the performance but it's i say it's just as well as a strategist they go in hand in hand and um only the only teams that i've seen that have a dedicated role to this were some teams at worlds so i mean this really works and um i have an example myself because our sister team had a much better robot than us, right? And they performed, they had a less, they had less win rate than us. And we had a worse robot. Um, that's just basically because we have strategy and they, they don't have no strategy role. They just go in with it. And that can leave a lot of great opportunity um, for some misplays. And that did um, happen a bit. So this is actually a very key role to winning. Not many teams are actually having a dedicated role to this, but it really matters. Like it will boost your win rate up a lot, like a lot. And even if you have a good robot, you can still lack skill. And if you don't have this skill, you're, you're going to lose the game most often than not. Even if you have a good robot so 
definitely strategy is a lot important. This role is being very slept on. And I want to know your... Okay, well, I'll... I'll finish talking about what I do first and before I wrap it up. But like, I've talked about studying opponents, but you also got to study the game, right? You have to watch, basically, like, probably the main thing you'll be watching is a lot of signature events. Find any signature event you can, watch it, take notes on it, and, exp yeah, just take notes on other competitions. I wouldn't go outside your state region, inside your state region, until worlds, of course, but, well, that's still hard, but let me... You go out your state region a little bit. See what the other regions are doing uh, compared to your state. And yeah, but also I recommend rewatching your tournaments the like the night or the day after you actually do it and take notes. See like hey, I could have done better in this match, or um, I left this side open. There's too much space over there. I could have took advantage of this. You're gonna have to look at that too. Um, there's a lot of factors, and all really, it, it requires time. Um, but ultimately, this role is pretty key to winning games. And also, another great point is that when you're in an actual, actual match, I practice this with my team, like, uh, a little bit towards the end of the season, but it works really well. Like, if you're really good and you know every possible scenario and you, you studied hours a day, like, you know this game, study both your team and the Alliance team together. And this might seem like a lot, and it is a lot. It is a lot to do. But it opens up, like, you can make so many more strategic plays because you know what your allies are going to do. You can, like, plan mid-game. And this can, like, this coordination is also pretty key. So I recommend trying that out too. But if you find that you're losing a lot of your games and you might have a good robot, this is probably why you're probably, you're definitely lacking strategy. Um, and yeah, that's all that I have in this video. Um, just any questions you have, um, put it in the comments. I'll answer them. Um, and then next, I'll go over, like, what like what you should write in the notebook to earn, um, uh, earn trophies and, like, what you should be writing in the notebook and how um, Vex looks at your notebook, like, how they evaluate it. So if you want to see that, like, subscribe, and any comments... Alright, see ya.